Now let's move on to the actual system settings. Click the FR configurator, enter information in the startup window. You can save it as a project file with a specific name. Click the Easy Setup button and enter the name of the system within 32 characters. Click Next. Now you can see the communication settings screen. On this screen, you can connect the PC to the inverter or set the communication. Select USB in PC side port field. Keep None in the Pass field as the inverter is going to be connected directly to the PC this time. Click Next. In the Inverter Setting Method dialog, we can choose whether to automatically detect the connected inverter or manually select the inverter to reflect it to the system setting. This time, select Automatic Detection. Click Next. Click Start to automatically detect the inverter available for communication. After the detection is finished, click Next to go to the Inverter Selection screen. Click Register System Setting. Click Next. Select a control method of the inverter. Retain the default setting of VF Control and click Next. Enter the motor information. Select Standard Motor in the Applied Motor field and set 0.1 kilowatts in the Motor Capacity field and 0.63 amps in the Rated Motor Current field. Click Next. Do not change the default setting methods of Start Command and Frequency. Click Next. The Parameter List dialog appears. We can set the parameters required for the initial setting. Click Next to return to the Inverter Selection screen. Click Finish to complete the easy setup and proceed to the main frame. Now the system setting is completed.